Hey, I told you guys, as soon as I see the information, as soon as it come through my desk, I got to let you guys know, first wave of restocks coming very soon, man. Stay tuned for the video. What's going on, YouTube, man? Thanks for tuning in to yet another video, man. Like I said in the intro, uh, something I've been trying to do a lot lately is help you guys out in the best way that I can. As soon as I see any information about restock, shock drops, exclusive access, any of that good stuff, I'm always first to retweet it to you guys on Twitter and I come over on YouTube and put everybody else on. So if you ain't following me over on Twitter yet, you're missing out. It's linked down below. A lot of people already know what's going on as far as this first wave of restocks for uh, the clean Air Jordan 1 Lost and Founds, man. If you guys are new to the channel right now, what I need you to do, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell for your boy, and please give a huge like on today's video. It goes a long way. You guys already know we're on the grind of 70K. I need all you guys' likes. I need all you guys' comments. Everything counts and is truly, truly appreciated, man. So like I said, hit the subscribe button, notification bell so you mess out on any of these uh, restock information videos, shock drop information videos, all that good stuff. Don't miss it by hitting notification bell. All right, you guys seen it, man. You seen it. Like I said, if you follow me on Twitter, uh, you know already what's going on. So for the first set of these restocks for the Lost and Found Chicago's, they will be dropping on November the 30th on DTLR website. And I'm already gonna say I put the, the website down below. And like I said, I'm gonna put my Twitter down below so you know it's gonna be some more restocks coming very soon. We've been talking about it since the initial drop of these bad boys right here. And we've been getting more information. So like I said, the first restock that we will be seeing will be on DTLR.com um, on November the 30th, which happens to be one of those sites that a lot of people don't tend to hit on. But this is DTLR's first time dropping these Air Jordan 1 lost and founds. You can expect there to be a large stock number. The only downside to that is the bot. I don't know how... You know what I'm saying? Their bot protection is for DTLR.com. But I'm hoping it's good. Last time I tried to purchase a sneaker off of DTLR, I think they had like the little spinning wheel or like a moonwalking man. I'm not too sure. But I'm hoping that it does give you a, a fair opportunity to grab these things for retail. And like I said, I'm up here to give you guys this information. I pay resale for this pair right here. And I'm helping you guys out. So I need y'all hit that like button, man. Help your boy out. We try to hit that 70K. I'm not keeping no information from you guys putting it out first as soon as i hear it so i can help you guys put you in a good position in order to get a pair of free tokens there's a lot of people out there that still don't have a pair people don't want to pay that resale value and people are still upset about the release for the air drone lost and found so like i said i, I did have to pay resale which kind of sucks but you gotta do what you gotta do you gotta pay to play and i definitely want to add them to the collection you know what i'm saying show you guys seeing what they're hitting for and with that being said you know what i'm saying i, I went out there took that extra step, took went the extra mile to cop these out into the collection, and I already knew. I already knew that there were going to be restocks on all these different sites, so I am putting myself in another opportunity to get a pair for retail. I've been saying since the beginning of the year, I definitely want to double up on a pair so I can beat a pair up, like wear a lot, you know what I'm saying, because I read that Chicago Red goes with everything, that age look, that sale, midsole, everything about this shoe slaps you know what i'm saying i love this sneak right here so i definitely want to give the the proper respect this dude by wearing it because you already know a couple years from now your pairs might get the little little mold on it if not if you guys do not know uh the air Jordan one breads dropped 2016 kind of like that glistening or sparkle effect i doubt that that will happen on this pair i think we more likely more likely than not we're gonna get some mold on these bad boys i hope not i ain't trying to let me knock on wood real quick i hope that does not happen but you gotta rock your kicks and uh, I just need to put a pair on ice, you know what I'm saying? Just a pair on ice, you know what I'm saying? So I can have a crispy pair for whenever the time calls for me to bring these out of the collection, you know what I'm saying? Take them out of that DS mode, throw them on feet. I need a crispy pair for whenever that special occasion is, man. So like I said, man, November the 30th, the Air Jordan 1 Lost and Founds will be restocking on DTLR's website. Uh, I'm crossing my fingers. I'm going to be on there November 30th. Seeing what the release is hitting for, usually with DTLR, you know what I'm saying, Jimmy Jazz and all that stuff, they always drop at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, and I think, what is that, 7 a.m. Pacific Standard Time? But if the time changes or anything like that, I'm definitely going to let you guys know first on Twitter. That's why I keep advocating. I keep telling y'all to follow me on Twitter because... Twitter gets all the information first. They see all these restocks that happen on Nike. 
They see all these little shock drops, exclusive access, and stuff like that. So you're missing out if you're not following me over on Twitter right now. Link down below. So yeah, guys, man, everybody cross your fingers. This is only the first, only the first restock that we have seen so far for the Lost and Found Angel Ones. I'm telling y'all right now, I already know there's going to be a lot more restocks. And I'll keep hearing about this whole Nike restock that's going to happen. I haven't got a solid information yet, so I'm not putting it out. But as soon as I do get some solid information from my reliable sources, definitely going to retweet it, reshare it, all that good stuff to help everybody out and getting a pair, adding a pair to the collection. Because I know there's a lot of people out there that really want this pair, that's going to deserve this pair, that are really going to appreciate it. And I would love to help you guys out, man. So yeah, man, I appreciate everybody for tapping into today's video. A uh, quick little rundown, November the 30th, restock for the Lost and Found Air Jordan Ones. Don't sleep. Make sure you're well aware of what's going on. Go ahead and make your detailer account, all that good stuff. And uh, put yourself in the best position to get a pair for retail. That's all I try to do. I hate paying resale, but sometimes, like I said, you got to pay to play, man. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Hit the notification bell for your boys so to miss out on any other content that we drop on the channel. And I keep saying it. Follow my Twitter link down below right now in the description box leave a huge like on today's video before you slide out like i said we're trying to hit that 70k and i know you guys can help me by hitting that like button and spamming the comments down below restock action you know what i'm saying quick little restock video and like i said it's gonna be a lot more for the rest of the year i probably say it's gonna be another like three to four huge restocks when i say huge i mean like big sites like dtlr nike uh maybe even hippie sports you know some of those little stores like that that we might see restocks on stay tuned for all that like I said, by hitting the notification bell and subscribe right now and follow on the Twitter down below, man. Again, man, I appreciate all the support. Thanks for tuning into today's video. With all that being said, I'm going to catch you guys in the next video, man. Peace.